A Cobb County mother continues her push for accountability tonight after she says a sexually explicit photo her daughter sent to a classmate was then shared among the students. Fox House Kim Luffler spoke to the mother today and joins us from the live desk with more. Kim? Well, the mother says this incident has devastated her 13-year-old daughter. She filed a report with Cobb County Police who say at this point the case is inactive, but this mother says she's not giving up. She's a bright girl, smart girl, beautiful girl, and she definitely doesn't deserve this. Alberta Poole says this all started back in April when her 13-year-old daughter sent an explicit photo of herself to a boy in her 8th grade class at Floyd Middle School. She said the boy kept asking her to send it and trusting them, she sent it. She claims that student then sent the image to classmates. It ended up being on half of the, the Google chat oh, with over half of the eighth graders. The mother opened a case with Cobb County Police, but as of right now, officers say the case is not actively being investigated. Should we receive any additional information or anything like that that um, would be beneficial to the case, of course our detectives will look into it, so it's not closed. In a statement, Cobb County Schools says administrators and Cobb Schools Police immediately opened an investigation after learning about the case, adding, quote, we are confident that district policy and state law, including discipline and mandated reporting, were followed. Legal experts say teens who send an explicit image of someone under the age of 18 can possibly be charged with sexual exploitation of children. They are seldom prosecuted if it's just friends swapping with each other. When they do get prosecuted is when that photograph that no one else was meant to see is either put on social media or distributed to others. So she's really done damage to the victim in that case. Poole says while no charges have been filed in her daughter's case, she wants something to be done. I would like to see some form of justice within the school, some form of really apology. They need to understand this is serious. Also reached out to the Cobb County District Attorney's Office to see if they intend to file any charges. We were told because the case involved juveniles, they couldn't provide any details. At the live desk, Kim Luffler, Fox 5 News.